In this quick tutorial, we'll show you how you can add graphics to your 3D shippers as well as your palettes. Let's start in Ardios CAD where we have a 2D and a 3D model. In Adobe Illustrator, I have graphics which I save as a native AI file. Making sure I'm in my main design layer, I can now use the Tools graphics menu to add this Illustrator as a graphic file to my structural file. After placing the file, I can use the Move tool to position the graphics in the proper location. In order to see these graphics, we'll update the 3D. And there you go. Notice that we can change the resolution using the view mode. Make sure the graphics are switched on. Select advanced and pick a higher graphic resolution. Let's go ahead and palletize this now. Let's pick a 4032 wooden palette and create a palletized design using cape. After specifying all the packaging and palette information, CAPE will give me the most optimal palette. A simple file, export and exit will send this information back to RDSCAD. An additional use case would be a tray for multiple containers. Let's go ahead and duplicate this container using the array copy tool and increase the number of containers to two in the X direction. This is what that would look like. Now let's use the bounding box tool to define the dimensions of the tray. Let's do this both in the X and Y direction. Deselect the proportional scale and set the height of my tray to 70 millimeters. Now let's pick the tray from my library. Using the run a standard, we indicate the length and the width of this tray. Using the ECMA B group, we'll pick this B10, assign a corrugated material to it, OK indicates the base face and we now have two cartons with a tray. Palletizing this I can do by selecting all three objects, the two fridge packs and the tray. Go back into the create palletized design palette group. Again, specify my packaging information and palette information.
calculate and send the information back to RDOSCAD using the same file, export, and exit. Additionally, you can add graphics to this tray as well. Hope this helped. Thanks for watching.